Hey guys, Ryan Hasha here with a quick video on how to get indexed in Google. Um, first of all, um, I'd like to, to say that search engine submission is definitely not the way to get indexed in Google. Um, nobody uses search engine submission anymore and that's because the search engines even themselves don't even use it. Uh, Google has a place where you can actually add your link. I don't think it actually does anything. Uh, to be completely honest, uh, I think you submit your URL and uh, it goes into the abyss. The way that Google's algorithm actually looks for your website these days is it uses what you call what they call authority websites, um, and and this is where page rank uh, comes into play. Uh, essentially, um, you I, I don't know if you've heard of page rank, but basically um, your page rank can be from zero to ten, um, and and typically a good page rank to be. Is, is a five or higher. That, that's a pretty authoritative website. Now, what Google does is it checks all of those page rank five or higher websites first. Um, so when you when you submit a, 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 a website, or sorry, a video on YouTube, for example, YouTube is a very authoritative website. Now, the reason it gets indexed in Google so fast is because Google spiders the authority websites first. So that that is how you get indexed in Google. So you need to have a link um, on an authority website um, to your article uh, and that will get you recognized by Google. Um, one other thing, um, there is actually two power directories um, that are still in existence. Um, one of them uh, is dmoz.org. Uh, this is what the, the directory that Google uses. Here, I'll just scroll up here a little. Uh, dmoz.org. Uh, this is actually a, an open source project, an open directory project that uh, um, multiple uh, users, uh, multiple editors actually personally edit um, every single request that comes in. So Google actually uses this directory as their search engine submission. So if you have a link from DMOZ, it is actually a good thing. The bad news for DMOZ is that it takes up to up to a month to get listed in DMOZ. But I do suggest that everyone goes and submits to DMOZ. So here's how you do it. Um, you pick your category here, and you have to make sure that you're drilled down. You don't want to pick a broad category because you can get denied for that. Um, you want to pick the most specific niche category that you can. So you want to drill down your, your, your selection as much as possible. So if I'm an accountant, click on accountant, accounting, business to business, recovery audit, accountant, okay, and I have audit software, let's say. So that's like multiple directories deep. So once I get into this directory, I'm going to go up here and I'm going to click on the suggest URL link, and it's going to bring me up to a page that asks me for a bunch of information about my site. Read this page properly. Do not break any of the rules. You do not want to be denied from DMOZ because they will take even longer the second time around. You don't want to keyword stuff your, your uh, title. You just want to make it a very presentable standard link to let people know what your site is. Um, and, and DMOZ is what uh, they call in the SEO world as a power backlink. So this, this backlink um, is actually better than an authority website. It's actually a powerful uh, link to your website that Google's algorithm actually looks at. So it'll check to see if you're in DMOZ, and if you are, it'll give you a little bit of a bump in the search engines. Um, there's also Yahoo directory listing um, that you can submit to. I, I, I've read that um, if, you, if you do the paid version, um, is the only time that it becomes an authority backlink. Um, that's that's still up for uh, <laughs> up for negotiation on whether that's actually true or not. Um, but I believe you actually can submit uh, to Yahoo uh, for free, and I believe you do it right here at uh, Yahoo directory listings. Uh, I'll show you the URL here, but you can just Google it or go to Yahoo and search for it. It's actually ecom.yahoo.com slash dir slash submit slash intro. So if you go to that page and submit to Yahoo, that's also um, the other authority directory that, that is
widely respected and Google uses it in their algorithm. Um, so go ahead and submit to those two directories. Um, I hope you liked the video. I hope uh, you learned a little bit about how Google is now indexing stuff in their search engines. Directory submission, or, or sorry, submitting your, your site to the search engines is obsolete. Um, and this is the way that, uh, that you get your site indexed. Get a backlink from a top authority website. Uh, this has been Ryan Hache, and I hope you enjoyed the video.